Hello everyone, as we're approaching the IL biology exams, I want to share a simple revision plan that has helped hundreds of students achieve great results. As you probably know, almost half of the exam paper requires skills that need time to develop for that reason aim to be done with the syllabus within five weeks before the exam four weeks to practice exam paper and develop those skills and another week to do mocks and do the final revision for your exam if you haven't made notes yet don't rely on the textbook the textbook has many details that you don't require to solve exam papers try to find ready-made notes that are exam oriented that will save you a lot of time. While going through the notes, don't go in the same order of these notes. First, tackle the topics that you find difficult or those you haven't studied yet. In addition, for every topic, there's a core part that is more important. So try to focus on those essential sections of each topic. I prepared an interactive checklist of the specification. I strongly recommend that you use it during your preparation. This will ensure that you have ticked off all the parts of the syllabus and you did not miss any of them. I've also highlighted the key terms for you. Those key terms are important because they will help you to build your answers around them. Set realistic targets on a weekly basis to study a specific number of chapters or to solve the number of exam papers. Review those targets every weekend just to make sure that you're still on the right track. When solving exam papers, quality is over quantity. Don't aim just to solve as many exam papers as possible, but instead solve certain exam papers, mark your answers and color code the questions in three types those that you couldn't solve in red, those you already know in green, and those that require revision in orange. Those exam papers will become your custom-made study guide based on your needs that you'll use in the last week before your exam. When solving exam papers, start from 2019. If you have more time, you can always start from 2017. But 2019 is the right exam paper to start with because this is the time when they've changed the specification. When solving the 2019 exam papers, first start with open notes. That will help you to revise the content while you're solving. For the 2020 exam papers, solve and mark per question. For 2021 onwards, solve the exam papers with time constraints. Don't forget to keep a couple of exam papers from 2023 and 2024 to solve as mock exams before the exam, but not on the night of the exam because that will stress you out. I wish you all best of luck for the coming weeks.